I got to tell you, Andre, everybody's talking about this setup, the new 4K with the Screen Innovations SIST. I mean, is it blowing your mind? <laughs> it's a match made in heaven. Oh, it's great that, you know, to finally have a screen that works specifically with this projector is awesome. It is awesome. And I mean, the uh, I just talked to a dealer a few minutes ago. He's already got three spec into jobs. I, I, I'm a little surprised. I, I mean, I knew this was going to be a hot product, but it really, short throws really can make a comeback. People are looking for bigger and bigger screens, and they, but not everybody wants to put a 10,000 pound, $100,000 device in their house. Mm -hmm. And so you can get now a short throw projector takes up very little space, and now with the right kind of screen, you get the look and feel of a 100-inch TV. In this case, 100-inch, but we can take it all the way up to 147, correct? Correct, the projector will do up to 147. Inch. So the projector will do up to 147, the SIST screen material will go up to 120, but we have other options too from screen innovations. We have our pure gray, our pure white will also work, not ambient light rejecting, but still a good option if you want to go super big in a light-controlled room, right? Exactly, and it, kids want to play the stand-up interactive video games, and if you have a... Yeah, a, I get it. A, yeah. A projector in the back of the room, the kids are making shadows on the front of the screen, yeah, but this now, that you can stand up to three feet away from it and still play the game and not be causing a shadow. Dude, in front I, of I'm nodding because I've got my 11-year-old daughter, we just had our uh, our party at our house, where we were doing Dance Dance Revolution, and you're right, I had the projector up high, but we had to pull the kids back because they were throwing the shadow on the exactly. screen. Exactly, so that's why you need one of these. So, uh, for all you Dance Dance Revolutions fans out there, this is the projector screen combination you just have to go with, so. <laughs> exactly. You know, it also leads, but gaming is a lot of fun on this. Uh, not. And I don't think of Halo, I think of like uh, Mario Karts where you've got, you know, three 65 inch screens to, or four rather, 65 inch screens to drive on. Yep. I think of video conferencing with my mother in Seattle from when I'm in Austin. So this as the center of someone's media lifestyle is a pretty good solution. In fact, if uh, with the, the floor mount, we were talking to Robert over BDI, I mean, you know, just lift this up on a nice cabinet. Yep. You know, put the screen right there and you, you've got something in the living room in just a matter of like an hour or so. Exactly. And just real quick, Skylar, just do a quick pan around the room to look at how atrocious this lighting is. Yeah, this if, is the worst lighting conditions you would ever want to watch TV in. I agree. If, the, if your room, if your living room is like this, you might want to think about moving. If, you're, if your conference room, same thing. So, so we've obviously been chatting a lot about the residential use of this, but um, edge blending is possible. We can see this very, very uh, 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 popular in the commercial world too, right? Right. On the, the commercial side, that there's a, a, a business version of this projector, and you add it with some software that allows you to blend the edges of this, and you could make a wall as big as you, you know, as long as you want of these projectors. That's very cool. Now we did that with you at CES, where we had was it two or three, two, two side by side uh, Sony projectors with a long SIST screen with edge blending going on. So one continuous piece of content all the way across the, uh, using two projectors. It was pretty pretty sexy. Uh, Sony leading the 4K revolution here in the CDO channel as well as in the Pro channel. So if you're looking for the very best, you're looking for the very biggest. This combination with the SIST along with the Sony 4K short throw is something to take a look at. Thank you.